So when women go through menopause, everybody knows women lose hormones. And we talk about estrogen, progesterone, testosterone. What we isn't talked about is human growth hormone, which is human growth hormone. It's exactly what it sounds like. When we're young, we have a ton of it. It helps us grow. It literally helps our bones grow, our, all of our tissue. So it peaks in early 20s, and then we steadily start to lose it as we get older because we're not growing. But we still need some of it for muscle maintenance. Bone is great for bone health. Cognitive function. You talked about muffin top. Having human growth hormone is part of the process of breaking down our fat cells to use. So it helps us manage our weight easier. But as we go through menopause, when women go through menopause, their estrogen drops quickly. Human growth hormone drops in parallel with estrogen. Nobody talks much about human growth hormone because the way to replace it is synthetic injections and there are risks related with that and the risks outweigh the benefits but blood flow restriction there's been research done and studies out there that is very legitimate that human growth hormone is increased to at least as much as very hard heavy lifting but in some cases even more Hmm. human growth hormone and that's because what the bands are doing they're slowing down your venous blood flow which means that When you work out lactic acid, I don't know if you've heard the word lactic acid or lactate is built, but normally our blood flow can whisk that away 